So I looked on the internet and really didn't find too much. Someone referred to removing the wipers and the cross, like the cowling. But I didn't realize I need to remove this kind of cross member piece. Um, when I first looked in here, before taking that last piece off, I saw there was a little, I'm talking about a, a passenger well foot rest getting all wet. So on this side on the fender, there's a little kind of valve and that was clear and free. There's a little bit of dust and debris here, but not much. And I poured some water in here to see where it was pooling. It was all like from here across water. So I felt around kind of at the bottom here and didn't find, first I was kind of reaching as far as I could before moving that cowling and I can only get my hand about here and that's where I kind of reached the end of my reach. And I was feeling around here where I felt what felt like the lowest part was and I wasn't finding anything. And then I went over to the right and I did find a spot. I put my finger in there thinking, oh, maybe it's just got some leaves, but that didn't really do it. Tried running a long zip tie down there and that didn't do it. Didn't look at reach to a curve. So then I said, well, I could probably try like some hydraulic pressure here. So I took a hose and shoved that as far down as I could into that hole to kind of make a seal. This is a pretty pliable, and a sil big silicon hose and then attach that to my garden hose and then ran water through it with some pressure and sure enough all that area drained out and living happily ever after again so sharing this with another volt owner who might have a similar problem with a car that's uh, collecting water after rain